We're here with the uh, Cell Advisor, one of the uh, base station analyzer solutions that we're providing uh, to our customers. And um, the uh, big announcement that we have today, it's what uh, we refer as RF over CPRI. Basically, uh, traditionally with uh, old uh, or conventional cell sites, uh, all the tests, mainly as an example for interference analysis, was made through coax. So as an example here, I have a coax connected to an antenna and uh, doing some testing. Now, this testing is for LTE advanced, but um, more importantly for interference, we're just looking into an spectrum analyzer, and then here in the spectrum analyzer is looking basically around the uh, signal type and form and um, and here I'm just gonna make a few adjustments and how people actually are truly looking for interference so as an example this is a signal from AT&T and the uplink it's in 709 megahertz so here we're gonna basically be looking for any type of traffic that might be happening um, so I'm gonna be enabling a few traces here and here what we have it's just the activity that is happening with the signal and every time that we have an interference this activity from mobiles um, that we're capturing although it seems that right now on this phase we see that there's no interference most of the times when we have interferences there's constant uh, signals being present on top of the uh, traffic from mobiles so this is kind of the conventional way on how the test is being done with this connectivity with coax cables. With the new cell sites, they don't have any coax cables anymore because everything is going to be fiber fed. So that's the challenge, that even though now um, all these coax and uh, the interference is minimized on the coax as well as any returns that might have be happening on the feed line is being reduced by fibers, the um, ability to access the RF signal uh, is basically being put on the remote radio unit that is on top of the tower. So a way in which uh, we solve the problem of having access and actually being able to look and analyze the signal from the ground is basically by decoding or demapping the information being transmitted on fiber. So that protocol is secret. Um, and basically, one of the first things that uh, most of the technicians now they have to deal with is again, is that transition going from coax to fiber. As an example, I have a, a fiber connector here. This is a single mode typically used in cell sites. So one of the first tests that actually is fundamental is related to a fiber inspection. So is that ability to look into the uh, connectors and see how clean the connectors are because most of the times what happens is that we might have something like that which is dirt around the core of the fiber so we, when we uh, perform the test of the fiber to see how clean that is we uh, automatically the instrument is going to be making all the tests and is going to be indicating on which sounds we have dirt on it so this is the first physical type of test that is being done now when the uh, fiber is, is clean and is checked so the uh, next step will be to analyze the signal so one of the things that we have in, introduced in okay. the base station okay. analyzer is that in addition to all the coax and the spectrum capability is to have the uh, RF over CPRI board which is going to be the one that is going to be decoding signals so as an example I'm going to be connecting the fiber into the instrument I'm going to be taking off the uh, spectrum side of it and I'm going to be going into the mode of RF over fiber which one of the options that we have there is RF over CPRI so basically here what is going to happen is that first we're going to be testing the main aspect of CPRI and that is basically here we have one SFP, we have all the information related to that SFP right here. And also here on top, I'm receiving a signal, which is in reality is being generated by the instrument, going to a coupler. This coupler is basically the one that we're using uh, for cell sites. So basically we have just a monitoring point between the baseband unit and the remote ready unit. And with that, we're going to be able to make actual RF testing from the ground. It's an example of that RF testing, just like with any other spectrum analyzer, we can do an spectrum test. And here, 
basically, again, we're going to be sending a signal out, then it's going to, go, going to go through the coupler, coming back into the instrument, and then we're going to be able to do exactly the same test as we were doing before over coax, but now via fiber. That it's, it's a, a big advantage to all the cell technicians to basically expedite the time that they need to do to find interferences, and without the risk of going all the way up to the tower to make the test. So it's going to be very convenient and the maintenance time, interference time, they need to invest in troubleshooting, it's going to be very, very short. So this is a big announcement that we have, that ability not only to test everything that we have been doing for the past few years on coax, the conventional cell sites, but now with the new cell sites, making all the tests from the, from the ground, uh, interfering with or uh, interfacing with CIPRI.